Right, okay, and we're back with some more heavy rain. Um, yeah. Let's, uh, let's continue. I, I'll be really disappointed if Blake isn't in this episode. I really will. Where have you been? He, uh, he spoke about drowning the rain. Um, he didn't make any sense. <laughs> That's very unconvincing, Blake. You don't let go of this man immediately. What's not? I wanted to threaten the, the, the shrink, not not Blake. What the hell's the matter with you, Norman? Oh, I remember this one better. You don't want to save Sean Mars anymore? I want to save Sean Mars just as much as you do, but that doesn't give me all rights. So you're gonna stop this shit. Doesn't give right me all rights. Ah. <sighs> and which one's this? Is this? I want you to assign every available man to finding Ethan Mars. <laughs> I want a man to find him day and night. Notify all agencies to start looking uh, for Sorry, it's, it's Blake. The train stations, the airports, the bus terminal. Go look at him be professional. On his ass. So if he moves, we know about it. Yes, Ethan Mars is the origami killer. They don't know that for certain, do they? Okay, so who's this? Ah, oh, it's Scott. What's happened to his head? Hang on, this is not letting me move around. What is up with that? Well, well, an old friend. Okay, I'm not sure if this is because it's wrong with my controller or not. Hang on. Nope, that's all working. So what's... what is... Oh. Right. Kept Lauren in the dark on this one. I'll pick her up from her place later on. Who was Lauren? I wonder what we're going to talk about. I've totally forgotten who this person is, and also why I. Oh, what's happening here? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's going to work. All right, okay. Now, why can't I do anything? I'm stuck. Oh. Do you know, I can't believe it. Do you know what I just did then? I completely forgot what the controls were. It's only been a week and I forgot that you had to press one of the buttons to make him move forward. Oh, what an idiot. Can I talk to these people? Or can we just stare at them like the other ones? <laughs> He's got freakishly long arms! Okay, we're off. He looks a bit like Lionel Blair. I tried one. Right, okay. So it's... Uh... Again, more pointless interaction there. <laughs> the most important thing is to grip the club correctly. When you feel ready, you swing. Oh, this is going to be a nightmare, isn't it? It's not going to work. Oh, what? <sighs> right, that one. Now, what am I doing? Oh, see, they don't tell you that there's like multiple steps to this. Let's try again. Three. Have a nice day, Mr. Kramer. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> nice lingering look there. Ah, it's back. Are we going to be back to Ethan again? He's a wanted man because apparently, according to Blake, he is the origami killer. Right, so this is an, another test, presumably. So this one I've got to try. I'm really, really going to try not to fail this one. Whatever it is, I'm going to go through with it. It's going to be fine. What? Ah, oh, it's a key. Okay. It's not cliched in the slightest. What's he going to find? Is this going to be like a scene from Saw? I've got to say, I'm intrigued. Well, yeah, we've already established you have that probably. Five minutes to cut off the last section of one of your fingers. <laughs> oh dear. If you succeed, you will get your reward. Okay, well, it's only a finger. It's not that big of a deal, is it? Come on, let us get on with it. 
Of course I'm going to do it, Xuris. I mean, look, I can't I can't fail this one again, can I? There's got, look, there should be a more hygienic surface in this place. I'm more concerned about that, to be honest. I mean, look at that bath, it's disgusting. So if I cut off a finger in here, I'm probably going to get an infection. Right, okay. Yeah, I'll pick up the thing. Why is it doing that? No, I don't want to do that, I just want to do it. Oh, these controls are the problem. Yes, I know, I know, I know. I, like, I'm determined to do this. <laughs> What's going on? Uh, okay, do it. Go on, do it. Cut your finger off. Ah, oh, okay, again, that's me uh, with the controller. God, this is ridiculous. Oh no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess up because of the controls. I can't, <laughs> I can't do this. Okay, okay, let's try again, let's try again. Right, I can't mess up, I've only got not much long. Go on, let's do it, let's do it. <laughs> this is ridiculous. I've done it again, I've messed up again, I can't believe this. This is insane, I can't control this game, and it's this is because I'm trying to do it this time. Right, when do I, do I still have to keep pressing it, like the whole time? Right. There we go, right, right. Okay. <laughs> See, again, you need sanitary, like, sanitary conditions. Okay, so what happens now? I've cut my finger off. Under the desk. Under, um, what's under the desk? The finger? How did he... Oh, this is ridiculous. Again, why has he not called the police? I know I keep asking that, but why? Let's give another bad video of Sean. See, he definitely would have got, like, hypothermia or something by now if he was still in that water. Okay. Is he not going to take the finger with him? Because he could go to a hospital and then he could get it put back on again or something. I have unlocked a new bonus. What is it going to be? Is it, is it like a finger? Or oh, the tip of a finger? What would you do with that? Lucky that patrol spotted his car. What's he doing in there? Beats me. You're the pro <laughs> off his finger. <laughs> is he going to escape with her on the back? Alright. Can I go and talk to Blake? Is it gonna let me do that? No. She's going inside. I can't wait until she finds out he's cut his finger off. That's just as well. We don't. Ethan, what happened? Cut my finger off. They're out there. I think they're here to arrest. Oh no! What are we gonna do? I think we've got to get out of here. Surely he could help her a bit. I mean, I know he's got lost a finger, but still, that was a waste of time. What do I do now? Can I push the boxes? No. Oh, I'm stressed. Can someone help? What do I do? Oh, for f oh, it better not do that thing where it then tells me to do another button. Ready? I might go. No, Stay Blake's here, coming. Out of the question. Come on, let's go this way. God, this is actually proper tense. Come on, why is he just standing there? Just move. Come on, Ethan, get out of there. Oh, crap. Not again. Why do they keep making me do this? I can't. Hands in the air. They probably ought to stop, shouldn't they? Because... Lieutenant, there's a man and a woman exiting the alley. A woman? Shit. It's that girl who went in. No Everyone shit, sure. I mean, that's Turn ridiculous. Why did he let her go in there? He said she'd be out of the way, but she went into the same building. Why isn't Norman wearing his glasses? We've got to keep going. Ethan, Ethan, He's coming. lost a lot of blood, love. I mean, just, you know. Come on, get out of the way. I'm... 
God, what's a lot of blood here? Oh, come on, Blake. You can't just start firing into a crowd. I know you'd love to. Is this, I'm not entirely sure this is a good idea. Come on, come on. Ooh, that was close. Come on, let's go, let's go. <laughs> oh, are they going to make me do it then? That's, uh, that's a shame. I mean, presumably, seeing as they're police, they can just call ahead, get the train stopped, or they can just, you know, seal off the other station, wherever they're going. So there's no problem anyway. Less than an hour ago, we heard from the police who have identified the man thought to be the... It's like Ed Miliband. Ethan Mars, father of the kidnapped victim Sean Mars, is on the run and should be considered armed and dangerous. A policeman... Why armed and dangerous? He's... And well, dangerous maybe, because he is an idiot, but... When if... When he's... He's not been, like, waving a gun around at anybody. It's a massive leap. Why are you helping me, Madison? That's what you I want to know. About me. <laughs> Apart from I'm an idiot who keeps getting him to cut bits off myself and gets electrocuted. I, don't know. I guess I just. I. I sometimes have these blackouts. Times where I don't know what I'm doing. And in that time, I may kidnap children. As if I'm someone completely different. And then set up like sort of the only thing I challenges for myself. Was... Why were you in that apartment? I was cutting off my finger. Hang on, if she just stays with him all the time and he has a blackout, she'll know what's happened to him. Maybe he'll lead her straight to Sean while he's having a blackout. Nah, he's not the origami killer. He can't be. It's just ridiculous. <laughs> okay. Of course he can go to the toilet. Let's uh Oh no, probably should flush it. Interactivity. Oh great, okay. Send a picture. Brad Silver. See, at this point, again, he should really be calling the police. Or and definitely handing himself in if he's convinced he's the killer. Oh, it's, it's Norman with his glasses on, I didn't realise. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, this is never going to work, is it? I can't do this. I turns out I can. What an idiot he looks. Oops. <laughs> Killer with a car. It's a pretty slim lead, but it's all I have right now. Oh dear. Where's the drugs? Oh, one last thing, sir. You should be careful not to overindulge in the water. It could be dangerous. Very dangerous. This is definitely going to happen to Matt. It's coming. Having a bit of trouble with the controls again. Okay, it's back in here. Oh. So this is too much to experience for great glasses. Okay, we've got Scott and the prostitute. Oh, there he is. What? Okay, I'm right out there and I just shouted his name. Unless he has a hearing impediment, why didn't he reply? Hi there, Manfred. Who is it? Okay, Scott. okay, fair enough, fair enough. 
Uh, okay, let's go with this. Do you keep a record of all your clients? Oh, yes, indeed. Well, at least the ones who pay. I can't imagine he has any, any clients. I can get a peek at that. Yes, of course. I keep my account books in the office. Is that what? I had uh, five people in in 1985. In a hurry, I have a list of all the. Was she going to steal it? What is going on? That okay. That was a really weird sequence. What was that about? Could someone tell me? Did that have some sort of meaning? I mean, that was like kind of David Lynch style. I mean, what what was that about? <laughs> Hello, Manfred. Hello, your call is locked, sir. A police what call the hell? A few minutes. I need to know who you are, sir. Sir. Hello. Okay, why did he? Ha I'm so confused. God, he's dead. <laughs> oh, God. That okay? I don't want to exaggerate, right? But that's one of the weirdest sequences I've ever experienced in a video game. There's that weird thing outside there, and then you come back in here and he's dead. But there's and he's already tried to call the police. Oh, this is so strange. How would you not hear what was going on? I'm calling the police. The killer has already called the police. Why? He wants us to be a scapegoat. We gotta get the hell out of here. Oh. We, we have nothing to do with his death. We were just here when it happened. Look, we're running out of time to find Sean Mars. The last thing we need is 24 hours in a police station explaining this whole thing. Well, yeah, it doesn't make you look guilty at all. Watch the front door. I'll get rid of our fingerprints from everything we touched since we came in. Oh, that's Better impossible. The police are going to be here any minute. Oh, this is so weird. What did I touch? I don't remember what I touched. The telephone? What? <laughs> oh, what else did I touch? Definitely that magnifying glass. So guilty. So guilty. Oh, please do it again. I touched, I can't remember. Well, apart from the body, obviously. What am I? Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, yeah, yeah, I forgot about that. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Come what else did I touch? The door handle, presumably. Okay, let's let's go. That's it. He looks so guilty when he was doing that. He looks so funny. Oh dear. Oh, this game sometimes it makes me want to burst. Oh. So, you claim the victim was killed. Oh, okay, so I didn't get enough of them then. Yes, he went to get something in his office. And then we didn't hear him being murdered. He did his face thing again with his that his mouth. Anything to a police officer. 
I'll tell you what, if it turns out that Blake is the killer, uh, this will be the best game of all time. Okay. She hasn't really done much, so it's fine. Do anything to hold him once again in my arms. Can I? <laughs> okay. Go on, Scott, use your best moves. God, look at those hands. Got massive slabs of sausage. Yeah, the audio in this game is terrible. Not just the voice acting, but also just the incidental music, which is sometimes just completely inappropriate. Right, okay, are we going to do a murder now? this up. It's for sure, though. He's my girl, see. <laughs> Where did that come from? Did he just have to have it on his person? That's Cindy. Please, man. I want to see them again. Please. I know, but I want to see my son again, don't I? And I've already messed up two of the challenges. And one of them was the easy one. Oh, what am I going to do? Oh, I can't decide. I'm sorry, I can't kill a man. It's just, it's just wrong. I'm a father too. But I'm no killer. So I'm pretty certain I've messed up, because I've messed up three now out of the four. Why is her face wet already when she was still wearing the, uh, that sucking helmet? The Yamato helmet. It's not much of a lead, but it's all I've got. This guy's the killer, isn't he? He's got that creepy. Could so play a Nazi in a film. You're looking for Look. my dear. Before, who told you about me? That's weird, isn't it? It's a weird sitting arrangement. Everything has a price, my dear. <laughs> what about you? Do you have a price? Forget it. I'm not for sale. Told you. The guy's incredibly creepy. I, I ain't heard drinking you had that drink. Some apartments for rent? You're not drinking? No. I am. Um, um, I'm. I'm not really thirsty. Uh, of course, there's a toilet. Can I? Can I utilize that? Oh, it's an emergency situation, obviously. I thought he stopped performing operations. Well, you know. Weird nostalgia for the past. Maybe they just, you know, likes to wear them, walk around the house, pretend he's a surgeon again. Ah! What? Little ferret. That's fair enough. Uh, well, actually, no, it's not fair enough. That's awful. Ah, oh, dear. He's not going to start hacking her up, is he? What the hell? Have you ever noticed? As soon as you start to do a little housework, someone always comes calling. I'll get rid of our visitor and be right back. Oh, this is ridiculous. Oh, that 
was an accident. That's a cool evil laugh. Oh, just run! Oh. oh, come on! <laughs> okay, so what? Okay, so have I failed that? Oh, that's disgusting. That is disgusting. He's got a comedy evil laugh as well. Hey, there we go. Oh, that was horrific again. I'm looking for the owner of a blue Chevrolet Malibu 83. I don't give a damn how the car got here, or whether you stole it or not. I just want to know who bought it from. Yeah, wait to get him on side. You trying to scare See, me? I wouldn't be scared of Norman. I never saw your Look damn at him. Car. Oh, I don't want to do this now. I can't. Okay. Okay. Um. I'm done. Um. For now. But I should be back tomorrow night, I think, and um, maybe, hopefully, be able to wrap this up because I don't know. Hopefully, I'm near the end, and I just can't do the great glasses now. I just can't do it. So, thanks for watching, and I'll be back probably tomorrow. Bye-bye.